WWE SmackDown will be taking place live this Friday from Street Louis, Missouri. The event will be held in the Enterprise Center, with around 9,000 fans expected to attend. Notably, this is the final live show before Fastlane. Fastlane 2023 will then air on Saturday. That big event will be held at the Gainbridge Fieldhouse in Indianapolis, Indiana in front of over 12,000 fans, according to WrestleTix. SmackDown will hopefully provide last-minute build-up for the upcoming premium live event. For now, not much is announced for Friday Night SmackDown. Fans know The Judgment Day's Finn Balor and Damian Priest will appear. It was also recently revealed that Raw's Jey Uso and Cody Rhodes, current challengers to the Tag Team Gold, will be in the house. Plus, Dragon Lee is scheduled to battle Austin Theory. With not much announced for the Blue Brand's next show, the company could offer a major surprise or two to spice things up. This article will look at a handful of things World Wrestling Entertainment may do to surprise the audience on SmackDown. Below are four surprises that could take place on the final SmackDown before WWE Fastlane 2023. 4. Carlito could show up as part of the LDO. The Latino World Order is a beloved act in WWE. Selena Vega, Rey Mysterio, Santos Escobar, Cruz del Toro, and Joaquin Wilde are all incredible athletes who have earned the respect of the fans. Unfortunately, the group is facing a major roadblock. Bobby Lashley and the Street Profits recently turned heel and attacked the stable. This led to the LBO challenging the trio to a six-man tag team match at WWE Fastlane. Interestingly, the Latino World Order hasn't yet revealed who their team will consist of. Most expect Ray and Santos to be in action, but it would be a little bit unusual if just one of Wilde and Del Toro joined them, while the other was left out. Instead, Carlito may finally return to television by officially becoming a full-time member of the LBO. They can announce his intention to join the match at Fastlane the following night. 3. NXC's Braun Breaker could attack John Cena. A massive match is set for WWE NXT next week. Former NXT champions will collide and renew their past rivalry when Braun Breaker goes one-on-one -on -one with Carmelo Hayes. As big as that bout is, two factors will make the match even more huge. John Cena is set to be in Carmelo Hayes' corner, offering his guidance to the former champion. Upon hearing this, Roman Reigns supposedly instructed Paul Heyman to do the very same thing for Braun Breaker. The match could very well be the biggest in WWE NXT history. To get more attention on the upcoming match, Braun could appear on SmackDown. Not only might the big bad booty nephew appear, but he may viciously beat down Cena for attempting to help Breaker's opponent. This would certainly add further intrigue for the major match next week. 2. Kerry Sane could return to WWE. Kerry Sane is a very talented former WWE superstar. While with the company, she won two belts and the Mae Young Classic. Her first belt in the company was the NXT Women's Championship. She then held the women's tag team titles with Asuka. Just prior to SummerSlam, word began to spread that the Pirate Princess had agreed to return home to WWE. While she is yet to appear on television, it was recently reported that her return is coming soon. The Pirate Princess could return on Friday Night SmackDown. She could then be inserted into the triple threat match featuring Asuka, Charlotte Flair, and Io Sky at Fosslane. Conversely, Carrie could be in Ahsoka's corner for the big match. 1. Jey Uso could surprisingly rejoin the bloodline. As noted, Jey Uso is on his way back to WWE Friday Night SmackDown, at least for one night. He and Kobe Rhodes will be there to address the Judgment Day's Finn Balor and Damian Priest ahead of Fastlane 2023. Jey hasn't been on the blue brand for quite some time as he had quit both SmackDown and WWE as a whole following the bloodline falling apart. He wanted away from his family, but for one night only, he'll be back on the same brand as them. A shocking twist that could change much in the company, including the card for Fastlane, would be if G. Uso betrayed Cody Rhodes to rejoin the bloodline. 
J, Jimmy Uso, and Solo Sico could potentially gang up on the American Nightmare, taking him out once and for all.